This is a historic photo of the Andronikov Monastery in Moscow, one of the places where Rachmaninoff's grandmother brought him as a child to hear choral chanting and the pealing of bells so unique in the Russian Orthodox tradition. The tower was destroyed by Stalin in 1928, but the sound of the bells as simulated by the choir can be heard throughout Rachmaninoff's all-night vigil. Here we have a typical peal where higher bells ring at one tempo while lower bells ring more slowly. Rachmaninoff recreates this counterpoint as the choir sings Slava or Glory in the 12th movement. Here the composer employs a single exclamatory peal to proclaim the resurrection. A special moment comes in the fifth movement where the light of Christ, Sviet, is seen in the darkness of night. We hope you'll join us on March 17th at 4 o'clock in the beautiful church of Our Lady of Mount Carmel in Doylestown, so you can hear the bells of Rachmaninoff's childhood in the full context of his transcendent all-night vigil.